Hello everyone and welcome to another GA4 tutorial. Today we are going to walk through on how to enable cross-domain tracking in Google Analytics 4. So it is very quick and simple to do so. Before we go there, however, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel. It helps tremendously to create new content. So thank you very much in advance. And let's go straight to the point. First of all, we're going to come here to our GA4. We're going to scroll all the way down in the bottom left and click on admin. Then we're going to go to the middle column and click on data streams. And before we continue, it is very important when it comes to cross domain tracking to set up your domains under the same data stream. So what this means is that both the websites, or if you have, let's say two, three, four, five, ten websites that you want to enable cross domain tracking for, they should use the same data stream. Once this is done and the domains are using the same measurement ID, the same tracking code, basically GA for tracking code, you are going to scroll all the way down here. You're going to click on configure tag settings and you're going to click on configure your domains. The second option here under settings. Once you click on configure your domains, you're going to add the condition. And here you can say, for example, the domains that I want to set up or enable cross domain measurement for contain, let's say, my test website dot com and here you can also add more than one domains once you are happy with your cross domain tracking measurement then you're going to click save and that's it that's how easy it is to enable cross domain measurement in google analytics 4. very important one more time in order to enable cross domain measurement you need both your websites or all of the websites that are going to participate in cross-domain measurement to use the same Google Analytics 4 tracking code or measurement ID, the same data stream. So the same data stream, the same tracking code with the same measurement ID should be set up on all the websites that you want to enable cross-domain tracking. Then you're going to come to your data stream. You're going to click again on configure tag settings you are going to come here and click on configure your domains. And that's it. That's how you are going to enable cross domain measurement. I hope that you like the solution in this video. If this is the case, don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day in any time zone and see you in the next video. Bye everyone.